Hi, just a quick update video here on that issue that I was getting on the DHO 800. It's nothing to do with the scope. So, yeah, sorry, Rogol, for any implied issues. And no, it wasn't uh, the teardown. It looks like I can actually reproduce it on the Siglent here. Although, white coat syndrome, white coat syndrome. Watch it. Oh, yeah, see? 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 Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it, you bastard. Look. Look. It's, it's the T-piece. It's the BNC T piece. Now, um, if we actually, like it's getting bad ground on there, if we actually plug in a wire in there, you can see where it's getting that high frequency crap from, right? This is just uh, crap just hanging around. Maybe if we go over to the non grounded Rigol here. All right, I won't bother editing this one. Non grounded Rigol, right? There's the high frequency crap that we've been seeing. Right now, if we actually connect, if we have no ground, then it's going to give us all. You know, it's just it's just not there, right? But obviously, that, that there's some sort of like high impedance ground thing happening, right? The it, I I think this T piece just isn't that great. I mean, I can I can physically change the T piece. Um, yeah, hang on. <laughs> Let's see if we can physically change it. So there we go. That one, let me grab another one here. And yeah, it was uh, a few people speculated. Tear down, okay. So let me, okay, we'll just plug that back in that, like that. And so we've got another T piece. Let's see if we can, re might, might be able to reproduce it. Maybe. It's just, oh. Uh, Maybe you can. Oh, sorry. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Oh, is that? Uh, oh, well, yeah, yeah. Okay. No, it's just, it's just like a grounding issue. So I'm saying, I'm thinking tolerances on this B and C, which is a bit dodgy, and it's picking up all sorts of crap that's in the lab. Oh, yeah, yeah. That one's. Ah, oh, come on. But you saw it there, I was able to reproduce it with a siglet, so it's nothing special, and it's nothing to do with the fact that this not, is not grounded. I was going to actually muck around with the ground lead here, and see if I could get it to come... Oh, now it's not going Oh! Come on. Come on. Come on, you can do it. Let's turn that second channel up. Oh. Whoa, look! Yeah. So, yeah, it's just, it's just a dodgy ground, really. Whoa, I need to get that repeatable. Come on, oh, yeah, it's just real. Oh, dodgy brothers. Anyway, if I, oh, if I ground that, or if I ground it to mains over here, it's still going to do it because the other, the Siglin, of course, is mains grounded. So, yeah, yeah, that was, that was not the, oh, that was not, oh, if I, take off the latch oh there we yeah come on you can do it anyway there's some sort of well ground impedance see and and i'm actually grounding that right so i'm actually grounding so this scope is grounded so yeah it still happens there right got it got it got it disconnect oh i breathed no oh no there we go on, on, off, on, off. So I'm grounding the scope. Now, grounded, not grounded. Oh, yeah. So anyway, there you go. It's picking up all sorts of crap. And uh, yeah, basically just dodgy connection on the scope. Yeah, there you go. And of course, it is going to make a difference. I've done a... I think, pretty sure I've done a video on uh, common mode noise on um, scopes, haven't I? Anyway, um, yeah, the fact that this is not grounded, that's why they actually provide you with a grounding lead. So, you know, if any of the, if you have any sorts of uh, issues like that, and of course safety um, as well, but uh, also for mains earth uh, referencing to get rid of um, uh, any external stuff like that. So, yeah, there you go. Oh, <laughs> that, yeah, look, look, it's fuzzy wuzzy. It's fuzzy wuzzy, that is hilarious. Now, can I look, right? Okay. Right, so that's fuzzy wuzzy. If I ground that. 
Uh, it's still a little bit fuzzy wuzzy. Still a little fuzzy if I ground it to my mains earth thing via one meg. Eh, but yeah, fascinating, huh? There you go. That's what you can get if you get a dodgy ground. There you go, mains earth, but it's still there. I can still see the high frequency noise on that, right? It's still there, but if with no ground, it's higher like that, but with direct connection to mains earth, it does attenuate that a fair amount. There you are. So on, uh, that's grounded, not grounded. <laughs> cool, huh? <laughs> I just happened to find it when I was reviewing the scope. Unbelievable. So yeah, nothing wrong with the Rigol at all. <laughs> Catch you next time.